Yenle, are you a goat? Hmm? Let me ask you, why will you be eating too much like this? In just few hours you came here, I have lost count of how many times you've eaten. Is it that when you're coming from there is no food, or you don't just know how to control your big stomach? Baby, hmm? be quiet. Who is this girl, and why does she act as if she owns this house? Uh, please, just ignore her, okay? J just ignore her. You say she should ignore me. No, my dear, you don't have to ignore me. And for who I am, yes, I am Miracle, me, me for sure. Hmm? You have to learn to maintain your lane in this house. Don't get on my last next too. Yes, because I don't like annoying people around me. Wait, 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 wait. What is even going on here? Eh? Smart, it's obvious that this girl is not your sister. My darling. What are you doing with your teenager? A minor for that matter. Smart, this is child abuse. Can you just calm down? Was I not the one that asked you to come over, even when I know I have her here? Calm down for what? Relax. This is child abuse. She's a child. Hi. <sighs> Yeah, did you just call me a teenager? Me, me, me child. child of you. Hey, hey, hey. Wait, they are not zealous. I know I'm in a good mood. If you try this, I will deal with you. And I will make me child of you. See, you, you are very stupid. You are mad. What, 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 what are you doing? Miracle, and I have a gift for you. A gift for me? Flower. Uh, thank you so much. I don't need it. I'm going to work. It's just flower. It doesn't bite. I don't know you. You don't have to know me. It's just a gift. Please. It's beautiful. You can see that. Right. Thank you. Thank you. And I love you. The flower is beautiful. You are too small to talk about love. You should be in school by now. <laughs> Thank you for but the But I flower. still love you. Go to school. Good afternoon. You? Oh. What are you doing here? What are you doing in my house? This is not my first time seeing you. Excuse me. Have you been monitoring me or what? Have you been following me around? You don't make it sound that serious. It's just that I love you. I'm in love with you. I can see you out of your senses. Now listen. If someone sent you, or you are kind of, I don't know, I don't know where you're coming from, go and tell the person that you did not see me. Now get out. Look, that's not the best way to treat someone that loves you. Be a gentleman for us. I love you. Yes. Get out. I love you. doing here? I, I, I thought I asked you to leave this environment. Look, I told you I don't have anywhere to go. Please just allow me to stay with you. I love you. Are you out of your senses? Who are you telling you love? You love who? Me? Uh, listen, you see all this thing you're talking about is none of my business. I asked you earlier today that you should leave this premises and you insisted. If I had somewhere to go to, maybe I wouldn't be here by now. Look, I love you, okay? Just let me be with you. I beg of you, please. I am sure you come from somewhere. And I'm telling you to go back to wherever you're coming from. Because you didn't fall from the sky. What are you doing here? Speaking of coming from somewhere. I wish I had one. But I don't. I don't even have a relation. Look, I am an orphan. I've been roving around the streets. Looking for a roof over my head. Luckily enough, I found an uncompleted building. 
where I called home. But the owner keeps building the house every day. I just had to leave. I've been having series of rapes attack. And now, I saw someone and you don't want to help me. It's going to be so callous of you not to help an orphan like me. Please, you don't have that kind of heart, do you? What kind of problem is this? How sure am I that you're not lying to me? I do not have any reasons to lie. I don't. I just need your help, please. I love you. God will bless you. Thank you. Hey, so hey, much. take it easy. What's that? I'm confused right now. I don't even know if I'm doing the right thing. Yeah, seriously. She's not related to me in any way. I think he's not safe keeping her in my house. You are right. I think you should go to the police station and make an entry, just in case. Um, I think that's also a nice idea, but I'm not even thinking of keeping her permanently in my house. Uh, but I have this thought. I'm thinking I should tell my woman to accommodate her for a while, while I figure out what exactly to do with that girl. You know, at least I can be supporting them with feeding, making sure they are fine. That is also a brilliant idea. Hmm? That's a brilliant idea. It's okay. Uh, let's just get down the street and take some. Amen. Awesome. You're sleeping. I'm, it's like I'm sleeping on your favorite spot. Don't worry. Just let me just sleep. Just I came back home. Why? 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 Um, I don't want to. I don't want to strangle you. Stand up and get out. Hmm? Get out! Did I do anything wrong by accommodating you? Me? Did you I have the guts to, to, to come and lie down on my bed? Did I also do anything wrong to lie down? Just lie down here. I'm your darling. Just. That's not should do anything. I'm just lying there. Try to lay in my bed. Get into the go into into the visitor's room. Huh? Get out! Like, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry! Come on, get out! <clears throat> Good morning, my darling. I see you already dressed for work. What did you just call? Me? My darling. I am not your darling. Neither is my name, darling. In this house, you call me Brother Smart. Do you understand that? Yes, my darling. I'm ready for work. Take care of the house. I'll be back. Take care of yourself, my darling. Bye, my love.
miyiz? Ucu. Do you know my name? Oh, where? Smart, my love, have told you about me. He knows I'm coming. Far from it. He never told me he's expecting any visitor. But don't worry. I'll be kind enough to let you sit down in the living room and wait for me. Okay. You're meant to sit quietly. I don't like noise. Excuse me. Who could she be? Smart did not tell me that he has a sister or girlfriend with a wife. You know what? I should have left you outside. But out of my generosity, I decided to let you in. And here you are. I sounded this as a warning. Sit down quietly. But no! You decided to show yourself. You went into the kitchen. What gave you the temerity to do that? You collected food without my permission. Why did you do that? Eh? Why? Listen. I agreed to stay here because I don't want to create a scene. Mm. Smart did not tell you who I am. Can you see this? Mm -hmm. This is the key to this house. Okay? So I have right to come here anytime I want. I have full right to come here anytime I want. Are you okay? Are you done? You see, to me, you are a total stranger. Yes, you are. Smart never mentioned your coming to me. So please, oh, don't get on my last nerves. If you try it, I will lock you outside and you will have to wait there till he returns. <laughs> what nonsense, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is happening here? Hi, sweetheart. You here? Hmm. Just keep in. Come on. I'm home. Why do you... Why didn't you go inside? Why do you prefer sleeping there? What do you mean? Your wife did not allow me to go inside. She said I should stay here and wait for you. <laughs> Who are you referring to as my wife? Are you joking or what? Hey, baby. Welcome home. <laughs> yes, I said it. I said it. I see, sweetheart. It's not what you think, right? But don't relax. Um, she's the reason why I asked you to come over, all right? I wanted you to get to know. Darling, you won't be like you're stupid, which is darling. Wait, what did you just call him? Darling. Not what you think. I'm trying to explain. Wait, wait. It's okay. You both should have fun, okay? Can you just come down? Let me explain who she is. Babe! Hi. Babe! It's not what you think. Back from work very late. Ah, oh, please, did you get the money? Let me have the money. Could you imagine that Smart is dating a small girl? She even called him darling before me. Did you listen to yourself? Just, just listen to yourself. Who concerns you if you carry the whole woman, the whole world? What you just, just go there and get the money. That's all. Or are you, are you, are you trying to uh, start having feelings for him? God forbid. It's just for his money, nothing else. 
You see, let me tell you, you have to just go back to that house and get the money. I have a lot of things to sort with it. Ha -ha. No, I can't go back there now. Maybe tomorrow. I'm tired. I need to go and freshen up, please. Do you know the gravity of what he just did right now? Do you know? Now listen, you pray to your God that I don't lose my girlfriend. Because if I do, you won't like what I will do to you. That girl is not good for you. It is better you lose her. Are you out of your senses? Have you gone not? Do you know how long I've been with that girl? Do you know how much I love her? Well, that's by the way. I wanted her to start accommodating you from now. Because I don't see the reason why I should be staying in, in this whole house all alone with a total stranger that I know nothing about. Being a girl for that matter. You know what? Can we stop going on and on about this? She's going to come back to this house. And when she does, tell her exactly what you told me. Believe me, you. She will not accept it. And by the way, you look really hungry. Let me make you food, my love. I'll be right back. And you look very stupid. What did I just get myself into? I think I need to throw this girl out of this house. I thought you called me out to apologize, then give me the money I asked for. How do you expect me to stay with a stranger we both don't know? Must you know someone before you help them? You mustn't. Uh, see, sweetheart, what I'm asking for is for you to accommodate her for at least a few months. By that time, I must have figured out how best to handle her, you know? Okay? Why don't you do that, my love? Babe, you don't get it. I can't stay with that girl. Don't worry, just give me the money. You go. Let her come over to see you, okay? Please. Alright, let's go to your house then. I will. <sighs> Are you kidding me? The house I paid the rent? The landlord has to determine who visits or not? I don't understand. Please, let's go. Ah, babe, see, I don't want to be the first person that will break the rules and regulations in that compound. Please. You should have been happy that no man is coming there to visit me. Hey, babe, just go. I will come over, okay? I will come and see you. <laughs> Guy, are you sure you've not brought in a ghost into your house? <laughs> I don't know. Seriously, I don't know. When would you visit it? Would you told me that Mimi called her by her name even before she could introduce herself to, to her? Okay. And I'm sure, I know vividly that I never mentioned Uju's name or anything about Uju to her. Secondly, you know I've wanted Uju to accommodate her for a while. Yes? She told me that Uju will never accept accommodating her. You know, I thought it was a joke. To my greatest surprise, everything happened as she said. Uju refused to accommodate her. I don't understand what is going on. <laughs> My friend, you don't have to be afraid. Nothing will happen. Remember she told you she has seen you before. So it's very possible she must have seen you and Uju. Uh, whatever, whatever. I, I think I need to run along now. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. At the office. No problem, man. Yeah. yeah. Take care of yourself. Okay? Make sure you come on time. I will, I will. Bye-bye. I told you we can't fool him for long. Would you, you are not smart enough. Yes, you are not smart enough. Would you say this is just a simple mathematics? Just look for a way and get the money. Eh? Would you, or, or do you need a prophet to prophesy to you that a boyfriend is broke? Why did you say I'm not smart enough? The guy wanted to follow me to the house. And you, you never wanted me to break him here. What, what, what do you want me to do? Just listen to yourself. Just call me mathematics. All you do is what? Send me SMS. Guy, come on, follow that call. And I will go out. What's wrong with you? Just do anyhow. Just anything that you know you can do. Anyhow, you can maneuver and get the money. We just need the money. You, you, you called it common mathematics. Can you hear yourself? See, you, you, you learn. You don't want to learn. That's the problem. I wish you can even listen to me. You have to bring any strategy anyhow. You have everything it takes to get this money. I don't know why you're doing this thing. Huh? Hmm. Welcome back.
Thank you, my darling. How was work? If I'm not mistaken, this should be over 15 times I've asked you to stop calling me your darling. And let me warn you for the last time. If you don't stop calling me your darling, I will throw you out of this house as soon as possible. And if anything bad should happen to me, it's going to be on your head. <sighs> Wait a minute. Is that a sort of uh, emotional blackmail or what? And you think I'm going to fall for that? Listen, it is high time you got used to me calling you my darling because I will not stop. And by the way, you're back home so late. I was worried. Why? Wait a minute. When was the last time someone slapped you? Like, when did you receive a hot slap? Because that's what I'm about to do right now. Are you out of your senses? I got you worried, like, like, as what? As my sister or as my wife? Are you okay? Look, we live together. And it's just normal for us to look out for each other. Don't make it look like a big deal. Listen, I think you really need to get me a new phone and a SIM card so we get to communicate. I won't be worried when less you go out and stay long. Ah. I don't even know why I started wasting my time talking with you. Because I've always known you as someone who is never serious in his life. Thank life. you. Oh. I got you some clothes. Maybe you, you have something to change into. Oh, wow. Really? These are beautiful. Thank you, my darling. I love them. And I made you something nice. Rice and chicken. I hope you love it. What did you say? Rice and chicken. Hope you love it. How did you get to know that I love taking rice and chicken? My instincts. He doesn't like to me. So, do you need? You see, this is the only good thing you've ever done in this house. Yeah. Thank you. Let me get this for you. Very humbly, as always. And you look very troublesome. <laughs> you know I can't question your love for me. And of course you know I love you. But the point is, at least once in a while I'm supposed to come visit my woman at her place. I, I don't see the reason why you, your landlord should dictate who should visit you or not. You, you are not a child. You, you're matured for crying out loud. Babe, you're right. But don't worry, I will talk to him about it, okay? Can you listen to yourself? Uh, babe, you know I've missed you. <laughs> babe, can you tell your visitor to excuse us, please? Mimi, get inside. Excuse us. Excuse us. Are you deaf? Get inside. Oh, babe, can we please go inside? Sweet you. And why are you taking me? My darling, I came to tell you that food is ready. I know you'll be very hungry by now. Why did you barge into my room without any notification? Do you want to kill me with food? Not quite a long, I finished eating. But what's this with food? So you're trying to say I should not be caring anymore. I just came to tell you food is ready so that I will give you good food. You don't want to Maybe eat. Maybe I never said so. Can you just excuse us, please? Like I should. The food is very nice, though. You sure don't want to eat? 
Mimi, hmm? leave. Before leave! They said they want to go! Ah ah! B, I think you should send this girl away from this house. I'm not more comfortable with her. I understand what you're trying to say, right? But, but the problem is, where is she going to go from here? Selling her away is not a problem, but I wouldn't want her to go back to the streets. Her life will be in danger, all right? It's fine, she wants to keep her. But me, I don't like her again. I don't like the girl. I don't like her. And she doesn't like you too. Well, it's obvious. But then, you guys should take things easy. With time, I believe you guys will get along. <laughs> All right. B. When are you giving me the money I asked for? Um. Baby is broke. That's true. I I, I remember. All right. Let me just do it as up. Okay. Um. Where's my phone? That's how we check check around there. If you can't see my phone. No, babe. You're with your phone. Oh, maybe I don't know. Mimi! Mm -hmm. Mimi! Yes? Mimi! Yes? Yeah. Mimi! Yes? Yeah, come. The food is ready. Please, did you see my phone? Your phone? Yes. Ah. Am I supposed to hold your phone? What kind of question is that? Did I see your phone? Is it me that hold your phone before? I thought you called me for the phone. Are you sure? Okay, you can go. You can go. I should go. Yes, go. I don't understand. What? What is all done? Maybe. Okay, well, yeah. Bring your ATM card. Let's go withdraw the money. Okay. I think you're right. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me get it. Wait, is this guy playing? Yeah? No, you must give me that money. Oh, babe, what is wrong? I can't even find where I get my ATM too. What are you talking about? Which one is it? You can't find your ATM card. Your ATM card, babe. I'm telling you. Okay, okay, okay. You don't want to give me the money, right? I don't understand. You don't want. Just say you, don't, you, you will not give me the money. Was I not the one just that promised? Just say you will not give me the money. So you don't want to give me the money. It's okay. I don't understand. No, no, Was I not the one that promised? No. You? Just hold on. Mimi. What's the meaning of this? Such a thing that have never happened to me. I can't find my phone. I can't find my ATM. Did I do anything wrong by accommodating you? This is the second time my girl is leaving this house angrily. Miracle, let me ask you. What will you gain if you spoil my relationship that I've taken time and energy to build? What will you gain? Look, you are yet to mention the main essence of this relationship. Money. That's all. Money, money, money. I don't know why you like crossing boundaries. Why? Why are you stepping on my toes? You're talking about uh, I spent too much on her. I don't understand. Is it your money? I don't understand. I, I, I do want to tell me how I should spend on my woman. Not to know that relationship requires money. Women need money. You don't tell me how I spend on my woman. Do you understand? Do you know what that is? Please, can you stop shouting? Enough! Yeah. Your phone and your ATM. You can have it. Run after her. Transfer all the money in your account to her. Take it. Go now. Give her all the money that you have. Since you don't want to see it the same way I'm seeing it. You do not want to see it in the same perspective where I'm seeing it from. Here. Yeah. 
Your phone. Your phone! You see, I think your mission in this house, I mean in this, my life is becoming clear. Because I, I, I've noticed you are here just to destroy my life and my happiness. And listen, I think I've gotten dropped here. I can't take it anymore. Do you understand? Look, I'm just trying to protect you, okay? There is no big deal trying to snook after you. I'm just trying to protect you. Don't make it look like I'm devilish. One more word. Oh. You won't like me. Easy, Tiger. You can have it. I am going out. By the time I come back, pack your things. You're leaving this house. I'm serious. Money, money, money. You can't just see it in the way someone is seeing it. Fat my things. Huh? Keep dreaming. Guy. I think Mimi overstepped her boundary this time. Or you do not inform her that would you also have the right to throw her out of that house? I am tired of that girl. Let's go to Ju's house. I want to apologize to her for what happened at home. At my place. Okay. It's alright, let's go. Eve, <laughs> <laughs> don't play. Eve? No, 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 no. Are <laughs> you lucky? Oh. Hmm. I thought you said your landlord doesn't permit men visiting this compound. Uh, okay. I guess this one here is a woman. Or is he your landlord? Guys, stop hiding your face. Oh, I'm very sure she doesn't know that you have a big man in your house. You two deserve each other. What is he talking about? I actually came here to give you the money I promised you. I never knew that all this while you cheated on me with a married man. You go to. Um, big bro. Let's go. Go here. The house you paid for. She must leave this house. Don't worry, it will soon expire. And when that happens, she will have no choice but to leave. Let's go. John, you will kill me today. John, after all I've done for you. Hey, John, you know, see, you will kill me. You're leaving this house today. Maybe I'll explain to you. Maybe you. they said the house has expired. I said you are leaving this house today, John. I don't know what I did wrong. No, like, seriously. I don't know what my offense, or, or is it an offense to love someone? All the effort I've put in, in love, trying to love someone, I, I always get hurt. Look at you. I do everything to make sure that that girl is comfortable. What she could pay me with is cheating on me with a, a married man. Ah, nah. I think I'm done with love. Love, I've given up. Nah. My friend, you don't have to talk that way. I'm sure the right girl will come. It's her loss. She decided to cheat on you with John. John of all people. I'm sure she's crying. If that if she's if she's not crying by now. But wait, a, wait a minute. You talk like you know that guy very well. Yes, of course I know him. I brought him to this town. I have brought him in my house for a good six months. Really? Do you know that this guy went and impregnated one girl? To make the matters worse, he brought her to my house without my consent. I had to push them out. This is serious. Now, you know that, eh? he took her to the village, left her with the mom, came back to the city, and started living with his girlfriend. I'm sure, would you? Would you might be the fifth one. So forget about it. You can always get a new person. A girl that will love and understand you. You don't understand how much I've put in love. 
You don't get it. Just don't worry. Everything will be fine. Okay? Everything will be fine. Let's go. Just let's go. Yeah? It will be fine. the shock of my life today. Uju has been living with a man under the same roof I have been paying for. Look, you don't have to get yourself worked up about this. Okay? Your own woman will come. I am certain about it. And when she comes, you're going to know. But in the meantime, just go in and freshen up. I'll fix you something to eat, okay? Get one of yourself. Help you fix it. Confusing. Like, I don't understand anymore. What's going on? I'm as confused as you are. Yeah, seriously. But then, Mimi is fun to be with. No, seriously. I, you need to see her act as my wife. Wow. And not just that, she also acts like my late mother. <laughs> your food is ready. Come and take your bath. This one is ready. That one, like seriously. Uh, but then I'm beginning to like it. Mm, yeah. I see. <laughs> one more thing. I've also decided to enroll her in a school. Wow. Yeah. Because from the look of things now, she's uh, more like a family. You know, she's playing a, a role of a sister that I never had. So I think I'm getting cool and getting along with her. Mm. You know, you deserve to be happy. Okay? You deserve to be happy. Um, yeah. I've not noticed her since I came. Where is she? Oh, uh, she should be sleeping at you. Wow. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, if you want to eat something, <laughs> you know I've not said this for a while. In fact, I've never said it to you if you want to eat because you know I, I can't do that. Yeah. But right now, I have someone who does that. So if you want to eat, I got something. 
Smart on my mind. <laughs> it's up to me after my nigga. Yeah. It's up to me after. All right, yeah. bro. So why is everything now? I thank God. Thank God. The business is moving. And where do you think you're going to? Hmm? I'm asking you. Where are you going to? Please, can you leave my way? I want to see smart. As what? Hmm? As what? Let me ask you a question. Have you no shame? I'm asking you. Have you no shame? So, after all you did, you still showed up your shameless face in this house again. And to think that me, Mimi, is going to allow you to come inside to see smart. You must be dreaming. Really? And for your information, FYI. Smart does not want to see you. Please don't speak for him. Mm -hmm. Go and call him or you leave my way now. As for what? I should go and call him as your messenger now. See, let me tell you. I think you don't even understand what is going on around here. I am in charge. Okay? I am in charge. And let me tell you. I don't even know why I'm wasting my time bantering words with a lunatic like you who has no shame, no self-respect and dignity. You want to see smart. What nonsense. You can fool yourself. Stand here, wait for him. As for this case, you're going nowhere. He took the spare keys, right? Excuse me. Shameless girl. She showed up. Everything scattered. Smart wouldn't have come to the house if she did not provoke me that made me live angrily. I would definitely come for you. Let me get smart first. Are you stalking me or what? I thought I've told you that I don't want to see you anywhere around me. What is it? Babe, please, I want us to talk. Talk about what is Ali? No, tell me. What are we to talk about? You choose a cute guy over me. So why not go be with him? Babe, I'm not with him anymore. He deceived me. He lied to me. <laughs> that, that guy is fake. Who cares? No, I want to know who cares. He deceived you. He de Was it not the same thing you're doing to me? I trusted you. I loved you. The only thing you could think of paying me back with is collecting money from me and giving to your lover. And on the other hand, he's collecting from you to give to his baby mama. You, you, you see the irony of life? You see how, how life works? Uh, listen. This should be the first and the last. I will see you anywhere around me. I will hurt you. I promise. I will hurt you. Rubbish. It is true that um, we are not related in any way. But you occupy a special place in my heart. Especially being the sister I never had. You've been supporting me. And also, you play a role of a mother in my life. <laughs> yeah, it's not funny. Okay. Above all, saving me from losing the company's money. I mean, that means a lot to me. That's a huge one. Um, I want to use this time to say thank you so much. I I will never thank you for granted. Look, you don't have to thank me, okay? Because you have done more than enough for me. Only taking me out of the streets, it means a whole lot. And I am truly grateful. Look, I appreciate. Thank you, my darling. <sighs> Why are you so bent on calling me darling? You never for once call me Brother Smart. I asked you to be calling me. Well, that's because you're not Brother Smart. You are my darling. Mm -hmm. My darling. <sighs> you're just so hard. All right, something came to my mind uh, some time ago. <clears throat> so, what if I asked you to resume school? But before then, where did you stop? 
Like... From the five. Really? Okay. So I wanted to resume school. Wow. Thank you so much. Like I, I'm very, very happy. This is this is the best news I've had in a long time. You want me to go back to school? Yes. Wow. But even if I'll go back to school, that should be less time because clearly school is only most games for this time. <clears throat> That's true. But then school close, school doesn't close. It doesn't stop me from still going to make some inquiries. So that when school resumes, it's going to be that easy. Thank you, my darling. Look, so I'll go back to school and... What? Are you not my darling? Hey, stop. So you're saying something. You say you go what? So when I go back to school, I'll become a graduate and I'll start going to work every morning. I'm going inside. Oh, you don't want to hear it. You know what? Just go. Let me have a nap here. Good night, my darling. Uh. I kept some money in my room. I want you to prepare something special. I'll be expecting Mm -hmm. Yes. Your visitor. Mm -hmm. I thought you told me you've given up on this woman. What are you saying? Like, okay, okay. I said I've given up on some women, not all. Of course, you know, I, I will keep trying until I get the right person. Oh, uh, don't you want me to get married? Well, I want you to get married, but just okay. Now you're talking. So uh, she may be here before I come back from work. So whenever she comes around, do well to entertain her nicely okay i don't understand in other words i'm not nice I never said so i'm just saying go extra my being nice to her okay all right i'll see you when i come back thank you have a great day my darling Thank you. Don't worry, just I will take you inside so you sit comfortably. My darling will soon be back. Darling? Anyways, just take me to the room. I need to freshen up. And hope there is food in the house because I'm so famished. Well, that won't be a problem. And by the way, the bags, are you going anywhere from here? Hell no. I am here to stay. Hmm? That's all. Hmm? Where did you say you got that girl from? Hmm? What did you say? Where did you get that girl from? And what is this expression on your face? Uh, meanwhile, she has been my friend for a while now. We met online. She has visited me here once and one thing led to another. We lost contact. So we reconnected again and here she is. This should be her second time coming around. Yes, exactly. Her second and final visit to this house. Are because you... what's this? Are you okay? What do you mean am I okay? You need to see the big bags this girl came to this house with. And when I tried asking her, she was like, Oh, I have come to stay. The annoying part is that I have lost count of how many times this girl has eaten since she came to this house. Within a couple of hours. I don't even remember how many times she has eaten. That girl is a foodie. Are you sure you can survive this? Huh? Um, are you serious? It's like I'm joking. I know I look like I'm joking now. Anyways, oh, my bad. I'm so sorry. I forgot she's your wonderful and special visitor. Please go and be with her. Excuse me, let me go. Mm-hmm. Nice. Hey. Welcome to that fresh. Okay. 
<laughs> I was even trying to call you to tell you to get me Shawana, but oh, really? since you are here already, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's get you Shawana. Bienne, are you a goat? Hmm? Let me ask you, why will you be eating too much like this? In just few hours you came here and I have lost count of how many times you've eaten. Is it that where you're coming from there is no food or you don't just know how to control your big stomach? Mimi, hmm? keep quiet. Who is this girl and why does she act as if she owns this house? Please, just ignore her, okay? Just ignore her. You say she should ignore me. No, my dear, you don't have to ignore me. And for who I am, yes, I am Miracle. Mimi for sure. Hmm? You have to learn to maintain your lane in this house. Don't get on my last nerves too. Yes, because I don't like annoying people around wait, me. Wait, 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 wait. What is even going on here? Eh? Smart, it's obvious that this girl is not your sister. My darling. What are you doing with a teenager? A minor for that matter. Smart, this is child abuse. Can you just calm down? Was I not the one that asked you to come over? Even when I know I have her here. Calm down for what? Relax. This is child abuse. She's a child. Hi. <sighs> Yeah, did you just call me a teenager? Me, me, me a child of you. Wait, I'm not in a good mood. If you try to listen, I will deal with you. You're not going to me, 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 child of you. See, you, you are very stupid. You are not. What, 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 what are you doing? Calm down. You're just coming. Relax, I'm going to fix everything. Uh, meanwhile, you heard her. Just calm down. Just make, hey, 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 hold on. Just take that wish to avoid me. Yes. Let her just avoid me in this house. I will. But then she said you she maintained your lane. Why don't you like avoid her? That's the point I'm trying to make. Right? What was this shouting the first day you entered my house? Uh, okay. All the same. I, I, I'm sorry for the inconvenience. Can you just say? Alright. That's it. I'm sorry for everything. Okay? Just calm down. I, I'll fix everything. Yeah, you know I love you. Please. Maybe I need to have some light. Yeah. <laughs> See, just the pain of I'm sorry for everything. Right? I'll tell I have a terrible dream right now. What is the meaning of this? The meaning of what? Why did you just imagine? Ah, my darling, I cannot sleep alone with that woman. I had a terrible dream. I'm so scared. Mimi. Huh? Since when did you start being scared? Ah, since now. Hi. If you know the kind of dream I had just now, even you said you don't want to sleep alone. I cannot sleep alone in that room. It's just a dream. My friend, will you shut up? I wasn't talking to you. Hey, 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 hey you don't, you don't, don't address my, don't tell my guests to shut up. Don't insult her. What's the meaning of that? But I'm still scared though. I cannot still go there. Do you see what I'm just telling you? This is what we are just talking about. What is wrong with this small girl? Let me just, or let us just give my name to the heart. Let's I just. I expected less. She's scared. I don't, I don't know the kind of dream or maybe she's. Let me tell you what I'm telling you. Maybe she's some of her time or something like that. So, okay. Why don't you just let us know what you're saying? Since she wants to stay there, why don't we? Okay, she's going to stay down with me where I go to the guest room. Then I'm going with you. Let's go to the guest room. Hold on. She said she's scared. Uh, and I think it's, she doesn't want to sleep alone. So if, if you still follow me to the guest room, that means she's sleeping alone. Okay, let's just, you know, let's just allow her. Okay? Where is it? Yeah, it's, it's a normal woman. And of course, you know, I, I can't also sleep. And tell her to maintain her name. Let her just maintain her name. Excuse. Hey, 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 
Am I not the one that is supposed to tell you to maintain your name? Hey, please, please. Oh. I don't want somebody that snores. Don't suffocate me now that I want to sleep. Zico, if I give you back hand, you yeah. don't. If I give you back hand. Mind you, this is my boyfriend's house. And it's, it's my daddy's house. See, I beg. Let me beg you, let me everything that you want to eat. You know you ate rice. You ate egg. You are ah, God, I will not forget everything you ate. If you pollute the air, I will solo tip your nose. Please, oh, stay on your leg. Please wait. I see this by hand. If I give it to you, if I give it to you, oh, mind you, this is my boyfriend's house. And it's my daddy's house. Okay, you want us to quarry? Hey, I'm in the mood for quarry. You don't want to sleep. Okay, now, let us quarry. You're even too. Oh no. If Asha will change location, she becomes a virgin. We almost did it last night too. And the little witch came out from nowhere and obstructed us. Huh. We must do it again this night. See this night. I will try it again this night. Yes, so. And after two weeks, I will tell him that he's responsible for the pregnancy. I have no other choice. Since the pregnancy refused to be terminated. Yes. <laughs> if there is any other obstruction, I just drug him. If I drug him, if he wake up the next morning, he just observed that the both of us are naked. That's just it. Just leave the little witches in the kitchen. What else? Cooking, of course. <laughs> oh, my dear, I'm here enjoying myself. Once she's done cooking, she passed food for me, I eat. As simple as that. Like I care. Oh, babe. Wait, wait. I'll talk to you later. The little witch is coming. Conversations on call. Can you believe that this lady is pregnant and I may go to for coming here to pin it on? Can you believe that? Mimi, let this not be one of your cramps or let it not be a crack. How serious? sure? How sure are you about this? No, 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 wait. So I can be playing with something as serious as this. Listen, the annoying part of this whole thing is that the girl is a rose girl. Yes. And that is why the person that impregnated her rejected and denied her. Yes. And now, all her plans to terminate the pregnancy has been abortive. That is why she's here, acting all nice. She wants to pin the pregnancy on her. You need to be careful, though. I told you. Be careful of these women, but no. Love her more. When I see man. I need to find that one. Find out why? Of course, I need to find out. Is this the best way of finding out? Must everything be found out? But you listen to me. You're not going to go and find out in this manner. You be. You need to calm down. Go inside. Act like nothing happened. Do not sleep with her. Do not get attached in any romantic moment with her. Don't eat anything she gives to you. Because yes, I also heard her saying she's going to drug you if you don't give in to her drug. Yes. Don't even expect you to say that. Just. Hello, babe. Who are you now? Hmm? I'm still at the office. Uh uh, office. Babe, you promised me that you'll be back on time today. See, it's getting late already. Babe, I'm already missing you now. Since I came to this house, you've not touched me. I, I really need your touch on my body. Yeah, and you think I, I'm not missing you? Yeah, sweetheart, I'm missing you a lot. You just that I'm having a stressful day at the office right now, but meanwhile, I'm rounding up to start coming home. So, very soon I'll come home to be with you, okay? Okay. 
So I'm thinking I want this our relationship to move to the next level. So um, I'm thinking we'll go run checkup, like do some series of tests about us. Maybe know our genotype, blood group, and all that. You know, it's necessary. Okay. Um, but babe, <laughs> that shouldn't be necessary. Like, I don't think there is need for it. And moreover. It's gonna be a waste of money. <laughs> oh, don't worry, don't worry. You see, I've already booked for the uh, um, checkup section, you know. So we'll be going there tomorrow, okay? Uh, so just calm down. There's nothing to worry about, okay? We, we need to, there's no way two grown up persons will be, be doing a relationship that is this serious and we don't even know anything about us. I, I mean, it's, this is a modern age actually, so it's necessary we know all those things, okay? <laughs> Okay, if you insist, I don't have problem. You know, most men out there wouldn't even mind. They are just different and I love you so much. Oh, love you. See you soon. Meanwhile, uh, Mimi went out to get some stuffs for breakfast. So when she comes back, do well to take care of yourself. As always. I will. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be back. Hello. Okay. Don't miss me much. Yeah. <laughs> breakfast, key hard dear. I need to leave this house before this, this witch comes back. Going to work. Yeah, I'm going to work. As you can see, here is my office, and right beside me is my Secretary. client. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Firstly, you think you can pretend forever? You know, I was actually thinking that Mimi has been wrong all this while, but what you just did right now proved her right. You're pregnant, huh? and you think you can pin it on me, right? How, how can she say that? My friend, will you shut up your mouth? What do you mean, how can he say that? Okay, where are you going with your luggages? That's right. Where are you heading? I... I'm... I, I, I just hold it. Well, I'm, I'm not here for all these things you're saying. I'm not ready to waste my time on you right now. I was actually going to work. Tessie, the first time we met, you remember? Tessie, I pleaded with you. You know how much I loved you. I told you, let's build together. Let's see what the end is going to be. You said no. You wanted a luxury life. You, you wanted this. You wanted it big and all of that. And you left for the luxury life. Only to come back with unwanted pregnancy, right? And you think the only way you're going to escape that is by pinning it on me, right? <laughs> huh? Uh, well, it's good you are living already. But I will say you hasten up. Get out of my house. Oh, my darling. No, now. Be nice to give her transport. Whose huh? money? Mine. Get out! Don't worry, your man can take care of it. Alright. You forgot the bread, though. Can you make it fast? Calm down now. She has gone.
If I tell you I'm the only darling you have now, you will say no. So close. The only apartment we have left here is around this compound, but I don't think it's available any longer because someone, I think someone paid for it last week. Yeah. But meanwhile, if you don't mind, I can maybe look out for one for you. Okay, I don't mind. Let me give you my number. In case you see any. All right, all right. Okay. Okay, so we'll come over here. Zero nine. Six four eight nine six two six four nine six two six four. Six, four. Okay, what's the name? Favor. That's right. Thank you. Right, uh, Favor. Yeah. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. Good day. Um, are you still looking for apartments? Because I'm still searching if I can get anyone for you. Yes. Thank you so much for your efforts. Well, you were not even the person I was uh, directed to. I guess I went to the wrong house. Uh, no, 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 no. My house can never be a wrong house. You actually came to the right place. Okay? I have your number and I would want to call sometimes when you check up on you. What about that? That's okay, it's not a problem. Mm. All right, thank you. Go and uh, get, get your water. So, sir, which water do you want? Cold water, hot water, warm water? Atlantic Ocean water. Wait for your wife. She's soon there. Yeah. Mr. Favor. <laughs> Mr. 
Mimi. Mimi, I'm home. Mimi. Mimi. compound, neighboring compound. I can't find her. I even went to the police station to uh, lay complaints. But to no avail. How can someone I've been living with in this house for a while disappear all of a sudden? Guy. I think that girl is a ghost. You know I've been suspecting her. Like, how can a human being just disappear into thin air? You know what? I think I will have to take you to a prophet. Okay. Yes. Okay. He's a good seer. He must surely tell us what happened. Mm, this sounds a bit uh, relieving. When do we go? Mm, on Sunday after church. Yes, so that we have enough time for us. Okay? My darling. Mimi. Mimi. Don't be afraid. Do not worry much because you cannot see me again. The thought I have for you is the thought of good and not of evil. My mission in your life is accomplished. Favor is the right woman for you. I came to make sure that you don't marry a wrong person. All those women that were meant to frustrate your life was driven away. And that is for you to know the value of a good woman. I am your mother. I discard a Mimi's form so that you won't be afraid and you will accommodate me. So that I will protect you against all these women who don't mean good for you. If you remember, because you have a great mission to fulfill in this life, I wouldn't allow you to go astray. So my son, hold what the Lord has given to you so preciously because with favor in your life, you shall fulfill your purpose on earth. You see, um, favor. Uh, meeting you wasn't a mistake. I mean, crossing path with you, you know, I think is a huge one for me. I'm convinced that our love is divine. You know, I can't really figure out exactly how everything happened. It's a mystery, I must say. Yeah, it is. Then, I now come to a conclusion 
that I want you to be the mother of my kids. Are you sure about that? You don't need to ask many questions. The handwriting is already obvious. That has been that being said. Um, hold on, what's that? Uh, 